right. Sure, we're up. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time it is there for you. I am Happy Tact. And it's Saturday, so it's Fire Emblem Day. We are playing New Mystery of the Emblem. Very excited about playing this game. And finally, finally, being out of the prologue. <laughs> My goodness. My goodness. Um, we're out of the prologues. That's what matters. That's what counts. Um, and yeah, it's it's gonna be a good day. It's gonna be a good day. It's Fire Emblem. It's it's all the things. It's all the things. Um, if the sound sounds not like Fire Emblem, uh, new mystery of the emblem, that is because the sound for my DS does not work. So we are listening to the Fire Emblem Echoes Shadows of Valentia soundtrack because it is killer. It is a baller soundtrack. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and get into the game. We went through like a bajillion prologues, <laughs> so we're on. It took us two hours to get through all the prologues and and one chapter. <laughs> um, but now we're back into the game. Um, Martha's doing things. We're helping Marth, and uh, yeah, it's been a good time so far been pretty happy with the game thus far. I have never played this one, so this is new to me. Um, it's new to me. So bear that in mind. Um, I play a lot of Fire Emblem, but have not played this one before. Which means we're not Iron Manning it. Basically, that just means we're not Iron Manning it. <laughs> but yeah, so something something. We're going to the Rebellion of Macedon which was something that they didn't believe was happening. Ooh, nice art. I like the art. Leaving painful memories behind, Marth and his company's left crust. They landed in Macedon, their new mission to rescue Princess Minerva. After the War of Shadows, Macedon was led by Minerva, who exiled the oppressive generals and attempted to reform the military. However, the influential General Rook opposed Minerva's peace-seeking ways. He assembled the exiled officers to instigate a coup d'etat. Caught unprepared, Minerva was captured by Ruck's followers, and his rebel army seized control of Macedon. Then, they dispatched powerful Draco Knights to guard the country's forested borders. Okay. Alright. Sounds like a thing that is happening, for sure. Neat. Macedon's main force consists of Pegasus Knights and Draco Knights. Both are fast and highly mobile units. Why does it still say I'm playing Pokemon Infinite Fusions? Let me... Is that what this says? No, it doesn't. That's just a... Uh... Just kidding. On screen it says I'm playing Pokemon Infinite Fusions, which is tomorrow. But on my stream manager on my phone it says that I'm correctly playing the right game. Excuse me. Pardon me on that. We're good. In particular, there are the White Wings, who fought under our banner in the last war. There aren't many in these lands who could match their terrifying speeds. I would have loved to witness their prowess. Happy, while we're on the subject of speed, your speed is, sadly, terribly lacking. The White Wings would probably reach their destination in half your time. Uh, I see. I'll... Be more careful, Sir Jagan. <laughs> is, he, is he just gonna insult us randomly? <laughs> or is that just like because my speed stat is low? Like, what? Hello there, Happy. Uh, you're. Why do I feel like we've met somewhere before? Oh, don't worry about little old me. The important thing is that I came here to share a wonderful tip with you. Have you heard about How's Everyone? How's everyone? How's everyone is all the rage. By checking it, you can see how everyone in your army is faring. You can watch your allies training, train, discover useful items, or even listen to their thoughts. So, if you ever want to know how everyone is, then take a look at How's Everyone. Easy, right? I see. <laughs> Thanks, I guess. The more time passes, the more things you'll be able to see. If you ever feel the urge, then go ahead and take a peek. Well, I'll be off now. Bye-bye. Toodaloo. 
Okay, how's everyone? What is that? Uh, alright. I worked hard today. Uh, I hope nobody was watching. Okay, so he just gets experience points? Yowza! I'm dangerous today. I want to go to battle already and show him what I'm made of. Oh, okay. So this is where you- this is like- this is the barracks. Got you. I got you, barracks. Now that's rare. My illness has subsided today. I might be able to fight like I used to. Uh, okay. Interesting. Oh, we got some support conversations, I'm guessing? I think I'd have to fight here again. Sorry, are you perchance acquainted with Princess Minerva, who's in the enemy's hands? Yes, Princess Minerva fought in the previous war as our ally. She even took it upon herself to fight her own brother, Prince Michaelis. All for the peace of Macedon. Oh, flashback. A hug. The princess had the three knight sisters, Pala, Catria, and Est as subordinates. Each of them is strong on their own, but their power together is unmatched. Triangle attack reference. With me! <laughs> Triangle attack, literally. Alright. Neat. Is that so? Sounds like they'll be good to have around. Yeah, however, Est, the youngest of the three, is retired from knighthood and is living happily in Altea. Catria and Pala should still be in Macedon. Hope they're safe. Um... Let's do our supports. Here's our Gordon's little- Oh, I didn't even realize he was Gordon's brother. I just thought that all archers must be green-haired. Alright. <sighs> I remember you met every now and then during the apprentice days. I thought it was nice that you had someone close to you. Don't you have siblings? No. Uh, that's why I'm a little envious. What's it like having someone close to you who's around the same age? Side! Good morning, Side. How are you? How did, uh... <laughs> How did the the, uh, the Pokemon go last night? How did it go? I was only able to stick around for a little bit. Um, and I definitely gaslit myself into thinking that Misty was not supposed to be there. <laughs> oh my gosh. Very silly. Uh, my brother's always been in my life, so it's hard to describe it. But whenever I argued with my parents or friends, I liked it when my brother stuck up for me. It's like a nice family. I see you quarrel too. Didn't go much further. Cross the Nugget Bridge. Very nice. Very nice. So, it looked like you were practicing for something. Like, are you practicing mapping for something? Um. Like what? What was um? What was the goal of the stream in Discord last night? Rody. What's that paper you're holding? It's a rough map of the area. I thought it'd be a smart idea to take a look around. Because the last time you put me in charge of a map, we got lost. And then you got lost. That reminds me we got lost already once. Yep. Not mapping. Okay, no big deal. Take your time. Don't you have any sense of direction? Come on, let's head back. Sir Jagan's looking for you. Say, Rody, if you look at my map, where exactly are we right now? I don't think that map is of this area. Oh no. <laughs> oh boy. Hmm. The quiet one? No. The stone-faced one? Nah. Ah, uh, it's so hard to choose. Luke, do you think you could stop giving me bizarre nicknames? Also stop staring at me like that. What? You, you don't like them? How about cold eyes? That sounds like an insult to me. Am I really that cold? Fine, what good ideas have you got then? I need no nicknames. Besides, nicknames are supposed to come naturally, right? Aw, oh, come on, I know you actually want one. You can't fool me. So I'll help you think of a fine nickname. One even a veteran knight of Altea would be proud of. If that's the case, I'll think of a nickname for you as well. Alright, remember to give me a cool one. Hmm, how about, should be more serious. <laughs> Rody with the jokes. <laughs> you don't like it? Then how about, oh dear, he's crazy. <laughs> I get it already. You really like to run your mouth off when you're in a mood. I do what I can, if it helps you to understand. Oh, those eyes. Your nickname has to be Cold Eyes now. 
In that case, yours is do it seriously. <laughs> Cute. Um, this is just about last chapter, okay. Okay. Neat. So we did house everyone. Let's look at the map. And find out what's going on, because I don't know. As we said, I have not played this game before. <laughs> what are we doing? Um, there's villages, which Marth has to be the one to go visit. Oh gosh, this is a big map. Wow. Okay. Uh... Rummel. A weighty but more powerful axe. Jammin, Dippin, Akia, Grent, Kron, Muhiro, Trelenzo, and yourself will be drafting 18 Pokemon teams in this, on the 16th of December for a hardcore Nuzlocke Fire Red Leaf Green playthrough. You're playing through with the team from the mock draft uh, Dipping, Jamming, and you worked on a week ago to get a feel for what it would be like and gauge how helpful some of Oh, okay. No, that makes total sense. That makes total sense. Uh, yeah. That's cool. That's cool. Sounds like fun. Sounds like a good time. Are you guys all streaming, like, simultaneously? Like, is that what's going on? Awesome. That sounds like fun. Pick... Pick units? Um, I think we want to be the healer. <laughs> Probably. Um... Does he actually have no growths? Someone, like, in the game said that. Some of you will. I don't think we'll, we'll all stream, though. That's fair. That's fair. I mean... It's still, it's still a lot of fun. Sounds like a good time. Sounds like a good time. Um... We'll do this. I don't know. Uh... There are a number of Lance units here, so I'm wondering if we should reclass somebody into like an, an axe class? Do I have axes? I don't know. Like... A pirate? You are a pirate. I don't think I want to do that. Uh, Luke, maybe? He's got decent skill. Although that'll all go away if he becomes another unit. Oh, he can't. He can't. Okay. Interesting. Uh, why don't you go back to being a cav? Maybe. Can you? Probably not. Nope, just kidding. So not everyone can be everything. Fascinating enough. Uh, Cecile can't be a that kind of unit. Can Gordon? I don't know that that's worth it. Whatever. Whatever. Um, I'll do a save. Oh, hello! Is it Pala? Nope, it's Catria. Prince Marth! Thank goodness you've come to Macedon. Catria? I received word that there was a rebellion in Macedon. Are you unharmed? Yes, I'm fine. My older sister Pal and I managed to escape somehow. But Princess Minerva was captured by the rebels. Prince Marth, please, you have to rescue Princess Minerva. At this rate, her life will be in danger. Of course, I'll help her. Catria, please take us to where she is. Yes, my lord. Break through the woods. Ye okay. If we approach from the front, we'll be easy pickings for them. Okay. Got it. I hear you.
I hear you. Some dirty thieves took our village treasure, the lady's sword, and ran off with it. Only women can wield the incredible power of that sword. Girl power. Please prize it back from their filthy hands. Gotta love a gender-locked weapon. There it is. We'll get it back. Don't worry. Don't worry, we'll get it back. Because of the last war, every nation has been forced to lead hard lives, and that's why every man inside all of these houses looks exactly the same. The only well-off country is Arcanea, ruled by Emperor Hardin. Okay. Beware when Draco Knights are around. Even from a far off distance, they can move all at once and swoop down on you. Got you. Going to the village, gonna talk to some people. Hey, now we get axe users. Cord. Couldn't sit still when I heard you was fighting again, so I came to join in. We're Talos' mercenaries, right? If you died, Princess Sita would cry. Prince Mark, let me fight too. I'll join you's army. It's a it's a guy with an axe. Hooray! Do I have a hand axe? I don't know. Did I buy one? What if to get two ahead? That is a pretty large uh, range there. Okay. Let's just do that. That way I know. Everybody's just making their way downtown, walking fast, going faster. I see. He's trying to leave. It's okay. We'll catch up to him. Look out for those pilfering thieves. If they take off with your precious treasure, you won't ever get it back. Now I'd let them escape from your sight. Alright, lady. Holding your groceries inside your own home? Warren's a bit of an idiot. Just because they paid him well, he went ahead and joined the rebel army. Ah, uh, to think a fool like him is once acquainted with the fair Catria. Uh, okay. So somebody, somebody knows what's his face? Oh, hi, Warren. All right, let me, <laughs> uh, well, we're not going to kill him. So, Katria, you're going to do some talking, I'm guessing? I'm glad I went to these villages because I don't know these characters. 
I would not know who to talk to, is what I'm saying. Uh, let's see. Hey, we hit. We hit, we hit. This is Sandalit in chat. If you need a Sandalit. Ourselves a steel lance. Making our way downtown, walking fast, faces passing, I'm homebound. So we're gonna send Cecile after the thief. Nice, I'm catching the sandalit side. Uh, which one? This one's Katria. You wanted to miss? Oh, is there a missing? Uh, is there a miss? Uh, thing going on right now? Warren? Even a good man like you is sided with the rebel army. Catcher of the White, huh? It's been a while. You know, I'm just a common hunter. If they pay me any enough, I'll do anything. Warren, listen to me. Princess Minerva endeavored to create a country where its people could live at ease. She exiled soldiers and generals of ill repute to accomplish that goal. But General Ruck, despite knowing this, roused the soldiers into a coup d'etat. Can't you see? He's just trying to make this country into his own. Can you honestly say you're okay with that? I see. Well, I don't like the military acting as if they own the place. Alright then, if you're gonna help the princess, then so will I. Alright. Uh, Not the worst idea. Um, She's fine. We don't... We don't need to do that. There, that guy's leaving, but he's not gone gone. We'll just do this. <laughs> yeah. I haven't checked what the, the latest missions are for PCG. It's been a minute. Yeah. I wanted to... Um, last night, Slowpoke316 and um, your Uncle Finch, they were doing a... Uh, they were doing a friendly Link to the Past randomizer race. Um, together and I wanted to watch that but I actually for once for once had <laughs> plans for Friday which is why I didn't get home till so late um, so I missed that so I'm gonna go catch up on the VOD um, but usually I'm just sitting in there <laughs> play playing PCG whenever they're doing something um, in one of their streams it's a good time it's a good time let's see go here and we use this this is fine do a little chip chippity chip 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 got, got ourselves a nice level here
Move all the way up. Iron Lance is fine. Drog. <laughs> There's something about like swinging the the spear as you walk that just looks a little a little extra silly. Just a, just a smidgen silly. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Maybe it's just me. Boom. Also, Cord has terrible posture, which is a great reminder for me to sit up straight in my chair. <laughs> I get it's stylistic, but it looks so silly when somebody has, like, like the worst posture you've seen in your life. Alright, let's do a javelin. Throw a javelin, please. Plus. Marth, just doing Marth things, I guess. Oh man, I'm so looking forward to September. Usually I just have like a little tiny bit of existential dread every time the month changes. Um, I'm like, what happened in the last month? What? What's going on? Like, why, why are we doing it this way? Um, but instead, instead, uh, next month, I got a lot of stuff going on, um, which is good and it's fun. Um, doing stuff with my swim club. We're doing a big social event next weekend, and then I'm going to my cousin's wedding. Uh, the following weekend, so that'll be fun. Ooh, a silver sword. Uh, so that'll be a good time. I'll be away for that weekend. And then, once the wedding is passed, I'm gonna cut my hair. I've been wanting to cut my hair since, like, June. But because I grow it so I can donate it, I, like, can't. <laughs> I got a trim sometimes around, like, May or June or something like that. And I had told the lady that I only wanted, like, the smallest amount that she could possibly cut off. And she took off, like, two inches. So I've had to wait even longer um, to grow out my hair enough to donate it. But short-haired Happy Tact will be back soon, thank god. Um, I don't mind having long hair, but it's a lot. <laughs> and I don't, I don't like styling it. <laughs> I really don't. So I prefer to have short hair. Shorter hair. So I'm looking forward to that. That'll be a good one. That'll be a, a nice change back. Um, I don't think I've had short hair for a while now. Not really. I was trying to figure that out. Um, let's see. Cap uh, Cecile, why don't you go catch up to this guy, but after I give you... After I give you... A javelin. Would be nice. Oh, miss. Only 67 hit. But we got it. Yeah, basically I figure, like, until my hair starts getting enough grays in it that, like, it doesn't make sense <laughs> for, or I can't donate it anymore because there's, like, a percentage of gray hairs that they don't accept anymore, um, I'll just continue to try and, and donate. It's a good thing to night. It's a good thing to do. It doesn't cost you anything. Um, except patience. <laughs> I guess it costs you patience. I didn't trade, dang it. Uh, that's 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 on me. That's on me. Uh, let's do this. Uh, no. 
so I think, yeah, I'll, I'll just trade now. And oh, she can't use it. I did trade. She can't use it. I was like, didn't I just literally? It's fine. This situation is also fine. Let's see. Lance, Lance. Ooh, crit. Oh, we love the windmill. I will say, though, like, some of these animations have really nice weight to them. Like, they, they look like what's happening is causing distress. Like, they have- there's weight behind these attacks. So, I will say that. Do I like the animations as much as, like, the GBA animations? Mm, probably not. Uh, but, either way, um, I think that they're pretty good. They're nice animations. They look rough just because of the system that they're on and, like, what the style that they used. Um, but overall, I think they're pretty good. Uh, let's see. Who should go over there? Uh, Luke, maybe? Luke has usually pretty high defense. This person have a... Uh, okay, just an Iron Lance. Got you. Got you. Um, here. Um, I wish that the R and L buttons took me to the next character, which is her, because I forgot that she's here. Don't need her. Okay. Wyvern Knight's usually speedy, so I'm wondering if we'll get doubled. Nope, we won't get doubled. I mean, our calves are like pretty fast too, so I guess that's fine. Uh, let's see. I guess we'll see if uh, he leaves through the left or if he tries to leave through the top. I guess we'll find out. Eight defense, nine defense, four defense. Okay. Well, we know who should not be the one trying to pull over this other guy. Warren. Hey, that's a pretty good level. Get some skill and speed is nice on your axe fighter all the time. Let's see. It's fine. Let's go up here.
Nice. Guess we'll do us a save. Do us a save. Ooh, a Vulpix. I just like Vulpix. But now that Side mentioned <laughs> there's a if you miss um, mission ongoing, we'll see if we can miss. We'll see if we can miss. Maybe we can. Oh, hi! I didn't think you would leave your castle, but okay. This is fine. <laughs> Nothing wrong here. I mean, the steel axe should be heavy enough. You shouldn't double. Right? 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 Okay, we're good. <laughs> Surprise, guys. I haven't been paying attention. Okay, yes, we'll get that. We'll get that. Um, wow. Wasn't expecting that. I don't know why. Maybe it's just because most Fire Emblem games that doesn't happen? Uh, will you kill me? Uh, 16. 12. Okay, we live as long as we get this guy. We can also block, so we'll do that. Just in case. Just in case the chapter doesn't end um, by doing this. We'll see. Oh, hey, I missed. Yay, I guess. Dun -dun. Okay, so she's safe. Uh, we'll throw him up here. Very much don't like that situation. Let's just box him in for a second. Oh, geez. Nope. This is a terrible idea. Uh, we only get hit once here? Oh, geez. Oh, boy. Uh, um, we are playing classic mode. <laughs> Do we care about Drog? <laughs> Do we care about Drog? Even, even if, I mean, he would have to dodge, right? Like, so that's 22. How many, how many hit points do we have? He has exactly 22. Of course he does. Uh, let's try this, right? So if I L fire you, if we had attacked with everybody on this turn, we probably would have been fine. And I do have a save point, so we can do this again. Um, from a time that makes sense. Um, well, it doesn't change what happens. So I guess we'll just wait. Dang it. How annoying. I guess we'll see if we get lucky. Um, is there anybody left? Bye, 
my drug. Oh no! <laughs> Never punished! <laughs> Never punished! <laughs> Got a little tiny bit lucky there. <laughs> Easy. Got my button. Never punished. <laughs> and we get a level. This, this is all great. Everything is coming up roses. Everything is coming up drog. Very nice. <laughs> Catria shields us over here. This is fine. And she dodges that, which is great. I wonder if she doubles this guy. She might. She crit him. Nice. My computer is struggling. <laughs> As per usual. As per usual. Having a little bit of a hard time. I'm just waiting for there to be ambush spawns that I'm not aware of. Because apparently this game is notorious for that. Definitely don't need to crit there, but that's I'll I'll take it. I leave the rest to you. Okay, buddy. Thanks. Obtained a steel axe. All right, sure. Why not? Serves a heal. Very untrusting of everything that's happening with some of these things. Uh, Warren, why don't you chill here for a moment, please? Uh, da -da -da -da. Hashtag concern. Mm, no concern? Almost. If I had gone my full move. Hey, plus magic. Hey, 
slow poke. How you doing? Welcome in. Happy Saturday. Hap Saturday, if you will. How was the how was the friendly yesterday with you and Finch? I'm sorry I missed it. I might put the VOD on later to be honest. Cause that sounds like a fun time. I'm doing well. Um, I slept a bunch last night, which is nice. Although I did wake up in the middle of the night. Um, but I did get some sleep, and I actually had Friday plans, which was weird. Um, weird but wonderful. Um, right as I was getting ready to leave work, I got a call from somebody else because they wanted to talk about a project that we were working on. And they're like, oh yeah, by the way, there's a happy hour for this program that we're working. I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> so I had like two hours to kill before uh, another group I was... I know from work we were going to go see a movie, and uh, I went to a happy hour, and then I went to the movies, got home a little late, but it was fun. Lind! How'd you wind up in a dangerous place like this? Sire, do you know this woman? Yes, this is Lind. Her natural talent for ma magic helped us a great deal in the last war. Prince Marth, thank heavens, what a pleasant surprise meeting you here. I desperately needed to see you again, so I set out to find you. But the Macedonian soldiers found me suspicious and they dragged me to this fortress. Is that so? I'm glad you're safe, but why were you looking for me? Shouldn't you be by Prince Nina's side? I was requested by Princess Nina to deliver you this. It's the Fire Emblem, of course. What else would it be? What else would it be? Huh? Yay for impromptu plans. Uh, the movie was good. Uh, we saw everything everywhere all at once, and this was my third time seeing it in theaters. <laughs> um, very much enjoy that movie. Still very fun. The Royal Heirloom of Arcanea, the Emblem Shield. The Fire Emblem. I heard that in the last war, Princess Nina entrusted you with it, sire. Indeed, I looked after this as Arcanea's representative in the last war, but why give this to me now? Especially at a time when Arcanea has so much influence under Emperor Hardin's reign? In this pe peaceful age, why is Princess Nina giving me the champion's proof? I don't understand either. Princess Nina wouldn't explain why, just that I had to give it to you. I remember her eyes seemed so sad. I think she may have been crying. Princess Nina crying? What on earth has been happening? Lind, after this battle ends, I will go see Princess Nina. Until then, I want you to remain with us. Yes, Prince Marth. We got the Fire Emblem, guys. <laughs> we did it. Game over. Series over. We've obtained the Fire Emblem. It's actually an item in this game, which is fun. Usually it's just kind of like ancillary. You don't get to see it. The Abducted Princess, Chapter 3. Your princess is in another castle. Once upon a time, <laughs> in a galaxy very far away, uh, the region of Macedon was a territory under Dorian rule. Please remind me about that later. Thank you. A century ago. Oh boy. Come on, you can do it. The Dragonkin rulers sent many slaves to the wild forests to excavate ruins and build a country. Races went well. Uh, your first race was super close and the second one was more interesting of a seed, but you both enjoyed it. Hey, that's good though. That's that's always good. I, I saw that you guys were, you tweeted about it or you put something in Discord about it. Um, so as long as as long as you guys had fun, that's that's the point, especially for a friendly. Always a good time. Many slaves were forced to work to their limits, barely fed, and then slaughtered. A young man stood up against such tragic conditions. Iote was his name. He and his companions fled to the forests and fought, astride wyverns to free the slaves. Where'd they get the wyverns? Um, after Dollar's demise, the slaves established their own country in these now abundant lands, and the hero Iote was chosen as their first king. And so was born the Kingdom of Macedon, later feared as the domain of Draco Knights. However, the mighty Macedon was stripped of Prince Michaelis, said to be the second coming of Iote. 
and is now on the brink of losing Princess Minerva, the so-called Crimson Dragoon. A beautifly. If you'd like to beautifully catch the beautifly, go ahead and throw a poke catch at it. Um, I don't want to catch it because apparently misses are a uh, mission right now. <laughs> I see you train without need for sleep. Most admirable happy. Ah, Sir Jagan. Are you going to tell me my speed sucks again? Strong offense and a tough defense are obviously important, but you cannot afford to neglect your skill. Without the skill to deliver it, it matters not how mighty your attack is if it does not reach the enemy. He has nothing good to say about us. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? That said, your skill is not bad. <laughs> oh my god. Jagan, why? The experience you gain from training and combat will help elevate your skill further. Be ever diligent. Yes, sir, Jagan. <laughs> Stop being mean to me. Stop it. Uh, Julian and Lena. Um, we have to prevent the villagers from being harmed. Yes. Julian and Lena lived around here. Lena. Allies? Yeah, I should tell you about them. They're now working in a convent, taking care of orphans. What a nice thing. I don't know if they've tied the knot yet. Julian's an ex-thief, and Lena's a very kind cleric. Julian risked his life to save Lena, who'd been captured by bandits. That was when I met them. You go ahead. Save yourself. Nice. Congrats on the catch. No can do. I didn't betray my boys back there so you could zap me on out of here alone. Okay. I see that you've learned to excel without sleep. Thanks. I'm a programmer and a gamer. <laughs> Lena's also has an older brother called Mathis. He's apparently in the Macedonian army. By Macedonian army, do you mean that Mathis might be among our enemies? Thank you for telling me this. Because I would not check. I would not check. I appreciate that. I do wonder why Princess Nina entrusted Prince Marth with the Fire Emblem. The emblem is to be given to one who fights in the name of justice, in the name of House Arcanea. Harden should have delivered peace to Arcanea. Appointing Lang as commander and now this drama? Just what has happened to King Harden? Jagan just wants to gossip and tell us we suck. That's what I'm getting from this. Very much a hard ass. Uh, Prince- oh well. Prince Mart said he'd go see the princess once this battle is over. Everything will become clear once the time comes. But now we must focus on quelling the rebellion in Macedon. Okay. Hey, we get a little support with Luke. Happy the order- <laughs> Everyone is just here to drag us. <laughs> it's pretty much a habit by now. Man, you're pretty crazy. You're already so skilled, I'm sure you can afford to take a breather. Well, Jagan keeps telling me I suck, so I'd die of shame <laughs> if I failed to protect Prince Mark. I see. You do have a point. Alright then, happy the ordinary. Do it with me. Uh, what's gotten into you? I'll train with you. We'll have a competition to see who finishes first. Are you alright? I thought you hated training. Looking at you, I figured I just can't allow myself to stay in your shadow. Prince Marth's knight, too. For his sake, I'll become much stronger. I see. My opinion of you has slightly risen now. <laughs> Happy the ordinary. Don't fall in love with me. <laughs> Not a chance. I wouldn't worry about that. What's that supposed to mean? I... yeah, I don't think that we need to worry about it. <laughs> Alright, what are we doing here? What do we got? Oh, that's a big map. Everything is a big map! Why is it such a big map? Hello? Uh, jeez. Louise! Um, yeah, okay. Huh. Something about a bridge. Well, Mars gotta go over here anyway, so that's fine, I guess. Um, okay. Pick, oops, pick units, maybe. Kind of want to bring Katria. Ooh, Lenny. Uh... 
see, like, if I could go get the villages with the flyers, then I might do this. But I can't. I don't think that that's a thing I can do. Um, I want to compare them directly. Okay. Katri is more useful. <laughs> uh, even though she's got better skill, but I don't think that that's a big deal. Okay, so Katri it is. Uh, let's see. Inventory. I know that we can reclass people. Like, I know that. I'm aware. Um... Are we going to? Different story. Nope. This one. Uh, let's see. What do we got here? Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. She's got nice weapons. Light magic for women. Lind can use at level E. Only Nosferatu for women. We love it. We like it. Reclass. Jagan, how could you betray me? You did nothing but be mean to me and tell me I suck. You caused me nothing but sorrow and self-doubt. Precisely. Uh, are you... does it matter? Hmm... You are a pirate. Oh, he can be a dark mage. Scary dark mage. Not a very good one, but certainly one to be had. Only shiny vampire magic for the ladies, apparently. Yes. <laughs> we love a good Nos. A good Nos for Atu. It's a good time. Uh, hmm. I think we're okay. No, I don't think I want to do that. Uh, buh, 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 buh. I think we're going to leave it as is. I have a hard time with like this whole... Uh, everybody can be whatever they want situation because many reasons. It's Pala! Julian, good news! Catria finally brought an Alta the Altaian army for us. We're going to join their ranks to help save Princess Minerva. Please talk to Lena and escape to safety quickly. No can do. Lena's disappeared. I'm not leaving by myself. What? Lena as well. Princess Maria is missing too. Why is it only clerics? Uh-oh, something nefarious is afoot. Anyway, I'm staying in the village to see if I can't find any information. Sorry, Pala. Give my best to Prince Marth. Alright, so he's in the village way the heck up there. Way the heck up there. Uh, let's find out. These folks. I just want to know where you're going to go. 
uh, pretty darn far, if I had to say. This is a problem. An arrow spate? Is that a ballista? <laughs> Good luck, have fun on Prologue 420, by the way. <laughs> Thank you for that. Uh, ballista, strong against flyers. Um, yeah, we hate a ballista. Are we outside the ballista range? We are. So as long as we don't go on the island, we should be okay. So this is fun. Look how many of these folks there are. Hey, Pala, are you gonna be alright? My lady. Um, only lances. Which is fine. Uh, Pala has nine defense. I'm just curious. Okay, I can't even check. What if I put her... So if she... If, if we have this, then she has 10 defense. She still only has 24 hit points, though. Uh, where is that again? Here. Yeah, every single one of them can attack her there, I think. Yeah. Almost all of them. Five out of them, um, which is too many. Too many. Uh, so let's... Let's maybe draw one to start. Um, and then we can get on the fortress. I think that's what we want. I think that's what we want. Um, and then we gotta stay out of this ballista range. I mean, I guess we can soak the ballista. Right, so that's that's what? That's 15? This 15. And we have 12 defense. Maybe we soak the ballista with Drog for a while, I guess. I would like for Katria to draw at least one of these guys down here. That way we can start trading. Ooh, some of these people have axes. Even worse. Even worse. Thanks, I hate it. Uh, okay. It's fine. This is fine. Um, it's completely 100% fine. Yeah, we're just gonna leave Drog here and <laughs> let him soak up whatever is happening here um, with the ballista. The, the arrow spate, excuse me, not the ballista. It's a ballista, okay? It's a ballista. No, we're really okay. I just... is there, There's weapon triangle in this game, so we're yeah, we're fine. Thank you for the hydrate, by the way. If you have some water, please have some as well. Make sure you're staying hydrated. And uh, if you don't have water, why not? Go get some. It's good for you. Thank you for the hearts as well. Appreciate the sound alert. Level up. Level up. Level up. Level up. Level up. Level up. This music is too peaceful for this. <laughs> Echoes of Echoes. Shadows of Valentia has like two modes. One is like very holy sounding music, and the other is like, you're about to die. You better be running. <laughs> there are two modes. Throw ourselves one of them. Oh, hello, 
thief. Hate that for us. Sounds like a not not a fun thing to have be happening. Um, this thief is coming. I think we can take care of the thief possibly in one round. Yes, yes we can. Because the thieves are gonna go after the villages. gonna go chill out on one of these forts for a minute. We're gonna draw this guy down here again, just for funsies. Uh, so we have what? Eight defense. Shouldn't outspeed me for sure. We're fine. We're fine. Why don't you go here? I don't know. That's fine. Fine by me. There's no rescue in this game, which is somewhat unfortunate. Can I- can we really not- nope. Only Marth can visit villages! We can't visit villages, because we're not real people. Uh, I guess. <laughs> I suppose. scary. Got that abyss. No! She's okay. But dang if that isn't close. Do we have a Volderary? Plus? We love ambush spawns. We love them. What are you talking about? It's 100% the things that you should be doing. guy. No, he, he missed. That's not good. That's not good. Uh, that's bad, actually. That's pretty, pretty darn bad. Uh, <laughs> hey, Katria, do you want to just miraculously have a critical for me, please? Please? Um, dang. It's okay. It might be okay. <laughs> uh, 8 speed, 16 attack. You have 1 defense, so 15, and you are really slow. 
Oh dear. There's no getting away from you. Goodbye, Melicia. We knew you well. Uh, maybe we'll just dodge it? Not likely. Not, not likely. Uh, okay. It's fine. What's an 82 anyway? Have you noticed that large drawbridge behind this village? Normally it's separated by the river, but if you use this key here, you can cross the bridge. Just once. Once you cross the drawbridge, the enemies on the other side will come and attack you at once. If you want to advance safely, you might be better off taking the long detour that goes right around the mountain. Here, take this key. No matter which path you take, do take care of yourselves, okay? We got a bridge key. That's fine. Do, 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 do. How much attack does... Seven. Okay. No. She's not dead yet. It's just likely that she will be. <laughs> um, it's just likely. Just a likely turn of events, you know. Thank you, random child. I love how random children just have keys to bridges. <laughs> it's a good time. It's a it's a pretty good time. Um, I guess let's go talk to these people. This is just between you and me, but I heard that armory is in league with the rebels. If you're going to enter, you should be careful not to get jumped. What? <laughs> Excuse. <laughs> this... This this armory do 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 what do enemy reinforcements come out of the armory? <laughs> I don't understand. I don't get it. I wonder what's going to happen to Macedon. They say that Prince Michaelis is dead and Princess Maria is nowhere to be found. On top of that, they say that Princess Minerva has been captured and that her life is in peril. I just hope that this country doesn't end up like Rust. <laughs> Fair enough, I guess. Okay. Well. Okay, the only one left is Drog. Hello. Hi. Who's this guy? Oh, it's Michaelis. Michaelis isn't dead, I guess. Instant gratification. I'm impressed a spineless coward like you could throw this country into so much chaos. I'll hazard a guess that Hardin talked you into this. Well, you, you're... but but how? Thought I was dead? <laughs> My death was but a trifle. <laughs> what? <laughs> Hand Minerva over to me, Ruck. I no longer have plans for this country. Do with it as you please. However, I won't rest until I've disposed of him with my own hands. Uh, but Princess Minerva is barely breathing. Nobody could save her now. Do you want me to shove this spear down your throat? I said, bring her to me. Y yes, of course. S somebody bring the princess here. Oh boy. It's been a while, Minerva. That ungainly appearance doesn't suit you. Losing Maria, your subordinates abandoning you. Is this the ideal country you dreamed of? Uh, Kalis, how? Okay, so Minerva's not here. It's been randomly abducted by her brother, who we thought was dead. Some of this may make more sense if I had played the other game. <laughs> However... However, this is fine. Dodgy dodge. Pala says, I see your dodge and I raise you one kill.
Bala just up here doing her work. Nice. Plus defense. Hooray! We like that level. <laughs> She's unarmed! <laughs> oh no. Oh no, no, no. Oh! <laughs> not punished. <laughs> We're not punished. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> we love it. <laughs> I was dead. I got better. She turned me into a new. I got better. Let's use something with more accuracy, huh, Ryan? Please? Sir? My friend? Yeah? Okay. Sounds like a plan. He's just bulking up. Ryan's just getting swole. Uh, yep, yeah, that's fine. Take <laughs> a good time. I guess maybe we can give this door key over. Why don't why don't why don't you come over here maybe? Uh I love this. The fire emblem, it's bears granted access to all treasure chests. Just sh just like point the fire emblem at a treasure chest and it just opens. That's amazing. <laughs> what a weird thing to do. To make Marth essentially like... To... <laughs> oh, oh my god. That's hilarious. I love that for them. Mark is essential Marth is essentially a thief. That's that's really what I'm getting. <laughs> he just uses his, his champions thing to uh I really wish that R and L worked to switch between units. These maps are pretty darn big. Pretty darn big! Just just saying. Uh okay. This is fine. Oh hello. Oh that's less good. We chose the wrong fort to be on. I think we'll be okay. Because we're on a fort. But I'd rather not have taken two enemies worth of damage. Just saying. Although she should double this guy, which means that it's a one round. Maybe she won't. Nope, she did. We don't have to worry about him next turn, which is good. Fire Emblem is super effective on Mimics. Wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. The abducted princess has been abducted from where she was already abducted. Naturally. Visits. You know, a little while ago, a paladin came here. He said he was on a journey. He was wearing a mask, but I'm sure that underneath he was a good person. It's Camus! Camus. Camus. Zeke, whatever you want to call him. The only guy wearing a mask. Uh, 
I keep hitting L like it's gonna take me to the next character, and alas, it does not. And again... I mean, if they both hit, I guess that could be bad, because she's got what? If they're the same as the previous guys, then that's 12 and 6, which is 18, and she only has 17 health. 12. Oh no, they both hit with 6. I can't do math. She's totally fine. Racking up the misses. As intended. Yeah, pretty much. I know. It's it's backwards logic. Backwards logic. That's a cute emoji. Can we math? I don't know. Maybe. Catria being very fast. As Catria is. Catria is pretty fast, I'd say. So now is when we would have to heal, for sure. Um, I think we want to heal. Let's go to this village first. Find out what they got here. Is it Camus? Nope. It's Bored. <laughs> Cord and Bored. <laughs> Long time no see, Prince. Cord already joined with these guys, right? We Talesian mercenaries want to join you's army, so we came all the way here. Princess Seed is our lady, and a guy who's gonna be her man is important to us, too. Prince Martha, I'll protect you with my life. Okay, sir. Hey, he's got a hammer. Hammer time? Do, 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 do. soldier because I'm bored okay well we missed with that one uh, we got another archer here so at least there's that uh, do us one javelin No Albert came. <laughs> I think we'll get him eventually. Um, that's just a reminder that he's back. 
He's here. He's a very likable character in uh, in uh, Fire Emblem Echoes. I just, I think Zeke is very cute, cool. I think he's a cool guy. This chapter would be really annoying if I end up having to redo it somehow. I don't think I will, but I could, maybe. Um, let's see. Who's this guy? This one? Okay, so two spaces. So we only get one guy, and it's this guy with a lance. Um, your defense sucks. Sorry. Sorry, buddy boy. Your defense stinks. Come on up here. He should hold up plenty long enough for me to get rid of all the wyverns on this side. Pala can start taking out the wyverns from the middle, from the top. Um, and then the archers can go reinforce Drog and they, everybody can get healed by uh, Malinci, Malici, Malicia? Malincia? Don't know. Music? There it is. So they don't want to come over here. I see. Except that I don't see. This night trio must be lonely without Est. You're literally talking to Palo. And I was such a fan of their triangle attack, too. 
Oh, West, come home already, will ya? Okay, random person telling that to literally her sister. Literally her sister. Goodbye. Just hit points. Nothing else. I wonder if they wait until a certain number of them can get pulled. Um, two? Well, let's try it, right? So let's just get him over here. Uh, do we actually have defense? We sort of have defense. Our speed is uh, does suck. <laughs> Jaken's right. Our speed sucks. <laughs> Let's both go in, I guess. You're not super important. So what we'll do is just back up a smidgen. Nothing but hit points for days. Nothing but hit points for days. Whittled down some of their forces. We almost outnumber them. Just good. Okay, so they're not coming, which is fun, I guess. Uh, where do you reach again? Okay, so as long as I don't pass this guy, Palo's fine. See if we can get rid of this person expeditiously. Can't get rid of this person expeditiously. Thank you for that. Making your little brother do all the work, including critting this thing when he does not need to. Dave. Katria is going to almost recover all her hit points. I guess we'll use the fort for the last one. I wanted to go upwards, but I don't want to send her without full hit points. Full send. Um, we might as well do this, I guess. I mean, if they're not going to try and attack me, then, you know, what's the point? Uh, 
can get in two of their ranges. So I'll do that. Maybe that will help. I'm just curious on if, uh... It's gonna work. Trog just stands there and takes ballista bolts like their breakfast. I mean, we do wish that he had, you know, like three more defense. Would be nice. But, you know, I'll take it. I mean, he is wearing armor, so that didn't make sense. He can kind of do whatever he wants. I mean, this is really where we're gonna find out, right? Like, how many of these do we need to draw in order for them to come attack us, right? Why not just step to the right? Eh, <laughs> uh, well, you know, everyone needs to show their strength in some way, right? Uh... I mean, do we care about board, really? Do we care? I will die. I have not enough speed for this. I mean, that was a dodge. I guess it doesn't matter what we do. I suppose it doesn't matter. Maybe they just don't move if you don't cross certain lines. Um, let's see.
Just in case of reinforcements, we will not be here. Get Katria. Somewhere that makes sense, sort of. I don't know where, like, the reinforcement zones are. And I'm a little scared. Of, uh, some of these guys coming down to get me. So we'll move one more down. And see if that does anything. Are they gonna move? No, they will not. I don't think that they will. Okay. Clear this space, which I can. If this doesn't make them move, then like, what are they even doing up there? We don't know. Uh, just hang out here for a moment, please. Liz. Liz. How many turns has it been? <laughs> it's been nine turns. Nine turns! Trying to get around this stupid mountain. I mean, you can charge up the front, but like, why? Why would you do that? Seems like not a great plan. healing him. This is fine. Let's get these guys closer. Alright, let's see. Lance. Lance. Oh, they're all Lance users. How pleasant. Okay. A little bit concerned over how much damage she's going to take. So she could take eight probably from all of these guys. Or rather, she will take eight, eight. Oh, he's got a master seal. Nice. Eight, eight, seven, seven. So thirty damage, which she can't actually take. Uh, and even if we, we would have to get rid of, um, we'd have to get rid of one of the eights in order for this to work, and for her to be okay, which we can do. Um, that's actually easy. And then for Pala, she takes 12. She takes 22. Okay. So this is easy. This is easy, easy enough. Um, Hits. I 
actually she'll take she'll take 16. So now it's now it is um, 8 plus 14. No. Yes. Oh, we got another silver lines. Fourteen, eight. I can math, right? Uh, twenty-two. Twenty-two. Now she's good. She's good. She's fine. Uh, I guess we might as well use this javelin. Hey, I'll take that crit. Doesn't really matter, but I'll take it. Maybe she gets a defense point, and we feel a little bit more comfortable. Nope. <laughs> but she does get strength and speed, so maybe she'll dodge something else that she wasn't dodging already. It's possible. Probable. Uh, I think we're good. Provided they move. Maybe they still don't move. I assume that if you get in their face, they move. But I don't know. Yeah, they move. Okay, so the first seven hits. We should we should live with one hit point. One or two hit points. Should be fine. Um, I didn't check speed, but Catria is pretty fast, so I'm not too worried about it. Not too concerned. Yeah, we live with one hit point. Just one. Provided the last guy hits, of course. So the vulnerary, I think, only heals 10, not 15. Right. Pretty sure that only heals 10. Uh, so she kind of needs to GTFO. I don't think she can get out of range. Um. Yeah, that's a little unfortunate. Um, I don't want Catria to die, though. Maybe I was ambitious. Got a Master Seal. Yeah, this is gonna be a problem. She can't get out of range. Nor can she get somewhere to heal. Uh, what if we get... I don't think we can even get somewhere that only one of them can reach. I mean, no. It's unfortunate. She's just gonna have to dodge.
Wish I had saved before. Before I sent them over there, really. Fortunately, they have, what, eight move? Of course, they have ten move for some reason. Not the same amount of move. Very silly. I mean, she can get this guy, but at what cost? I mean, she's gonna die. She has to dodge one or it's done. Um, we're gonna do this just in case. I mean, maybe we can draw them with that. This area is fine. This area is also fine. Dang it. Yep. Attacking Drog. Dodge plus. Well, this one we don't care if you dodge or not. Dodging is nice, but it's not necessary here. You do need to dodge. This- oh, good, 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 good. That's actually good. That's actually really good. Actually great. She lives. She lives. Perfect. I'm glad that I kept myself over here in reserve. <laughs> um, using the sparkly vampire magic. We love it. We love a good Nas. We did it, guys. We did it. Yeah, because this won't hurt. Well, it's going to hurt, but it's not going to be the worst thing ever. It's not going to be the worst thing ever. Nice. Exactly. The reason that worked, of course, is because my defense sucks compared to Katria's. I only have five defense. And that's why that worked. Uh, Katria... Katria plus... Alright, all those guys are gone, which is great, perfect, amazing, love to see it. Oh, we can start coming all the way up here. Ambush spawns, please. There a talk conversation? No. Why would there be a talk conversation? I 
think we want Pala to take one more guy down, and then we might just promote Pala, because Pala. This game, unlike the last ROM hack that we played, uh, it does not trivialize flyers. <laughs> flyers are, in fact, very good. Generally speaking. Let's go to talk to Julian. Julian, I'd heard you'd gone to Macedon with Lena, but to think we'd cross paths here. You literally were looking for him, Marth. Like, how should I say this? Lena suddenly up and vanished. I, I don't know what to do. Wait, Julian, tell me what happened in detail. Lena's been missing since last night. The villagers speak of some sort of strange priest prowling around lately. It seems that somehow Lena was taken by this man. A priest? Julian, as it turns out, Princess Maria has also gone missing. I have a terrible feeling about this. Anyway, staying here won't solve anything. Come with us. I'm worried for Lena, too. We'll all help to look for her. That's Marth. Thank you. Nothing would please me more. We got the thief. We got Julian. He's got a mend. Because he's saving... Aw, oh, he's carrying around the men's staff for his girlfriend. <laughs> That's cute. We love it. Love to see it. Oh my gosh. Sorry about the yawn, guys. I did sleep last night. It's been a little inconsistent. This week has been inconsistent. Um, Pala. Let's see. Can I get one of these guys to come up here? Let's find out. Time to find out. Let's see. She's probably fine. Uh, but let's check. 14. This guy is gonna do... 16 minus 11. Oh, she's totally good. Pala is a beast. In a good way. In a good way. Why don't you come up here and fight me? Just saying. Just saying. No? You don't want to? Well, fine. Guess I can't blame you. Pala is pretty scary. Just saying. Axum Hearth, welcome in. Oh snap, I'm running an Iron Man of this one on Hard 1. New Mystery, probably one of the hardest FE out there. Well, we're also playing on Classic um, Hard 1. That's the mode that we're on right now. Um, I've never played this one before, so we are not Iron Manning it. Um, but if the chapter is too long and I don't feel like going back for a character, then we won't. We'll just continue. As I understand it, if you, like, lose all of your characters except for Marth, you start getting, like, random characters that are just, like, randomly generated. Um, but welcome in, Axum. How you doing? Um, if you didn't already know, I am Happy Tact. I don't- I haven't seen you around too often. Um, we play Fire Emblem, we play Pokemon, we do other things sometimes. Did a Maniac Completionist before. It was really- I, I bet. Maniac and Maddening Modes. Like, I understand why they're there, but also, why are they there? <laughs> um, there's, they're just a lot. I love Fire Emblem, don't get me wrong, I really do. I love this game, I love this series, I love doing tactics and doing math. Um, that's part of my job, <laughs> but yeah. Uh, it's certainly a lot to take. 
let's see. Uh, Skeen's great to Iron Man if you lose a lot early game due to er the generation of characters. Yeah, I think I saw that one time with somebody, somebody had, uh, an Iron Man that they were doing on, on YouTube or something, and, because I have a tendency, or I had a tendency when I was in grad school to just leave, uh, leave random Fire Emblem stream series up and running while I was doing homework and stuff, and I just kind of be like, sort of listening in the background <laughs> but yeah we're, we've taken care of all the draco knights on the map um we've been letting drog like soak up as much of the ballista as possible um but this map is really huge i'm finding that pretty much all of these maps are really large okay we'll see you in a few slow see you in a bit but yeah well how's it how's your iron man going then any uh, any fun class changes that you've done? <laughs> Very brave of you to choose Mage, Chris. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I was trying to think of like what I would want to be if it was me. Um, I'd want to be a mage. But Jagens keeps keeps dragging us and telling us that we suck. <laughs> so maybe I'll change classes at some point. A lot of it is reclassing every map to write things. Oh, to rig things so that they complete faster, yeah. I would agree with that. 100%. 15 turns of this. 15 turns. Also, I didn't realize that, like, when I picked large text, it would only make my name in large text. So that's been a little, like, a little upsetting <laughs> to have extra large text for no reason. But right now, pretty much everyone's in their normal classes. I have reclassed people a little bit, but not a whole lot. Not a whole lot. But yeah. You've lost three units. Katri, unfortunately, to a double 0.3% crit. Oh my god. Rad and Athena. But you went Chris Fighter, so you had access to General Horseman and Berserker later. Yeah, so we're using female Chris, which means we don't have access to some of those classes. Very upsetting. Um, having class locks is upsetting in general. First time on Maniac, you did Chris Paladin, which was good too. Fighter general line. Yeah, I'm getting the feeling that that might be a good line to, to try for this. Um, but yeah, our units are pretty okay. They're all right. Um, let's prep and be ready to do things. Yeah, it's a little bit more limiting. Yeah, I can see that. Maybe on a future playthrough I'll use male Chris instead. But, oh well. Paladin and Draco Knight's probably- yeah, I would say that's probably true. Draco Knight. Yeah, flyers are good. It's It feels good to have, like, good- like, flyers be good again, because- what we played before this was a ROM hack where they trivialized using flyers. Like, flyers was not the choice. It was not the move. It didn't gain you anything on those maps. Um, so I'm, I'm glad to be playing a game where flyers <laughs> make the maps easier. We just finished... Um, shoot! We just vision, finished uh, Vision Quest, like, a couple weeks ago. So, that was fun. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. Yeah, yeah. I can tell with their 10 move. I would say, yeah, flyers. Flyers and then the, the high status uh, generals for sure. Ooh, Seismitoad. If you play the Pokemon community game... There's a fun little thing going on right now in chat. Go ahead and do uh, exclamation point poke start if you're not playing and you would like to. Alright. One more turn of wait and see.
mean, I guess I could have changed myself into a cleric and that would absolutely be worse, but oh well, it's fine. It's really okay. Everything is good. Everything is awesome. Everything is cool when you're part of a team. Alright, so we're gonna... Where's Katria? Katria has all of our hit points back. Hooray! Do I need him down here? I don't think I do. That's fun. I forgot about those little gems. Oh hey, Mathis! Who needs to talk to Mathis again? Who needs to talk to this guy? Is it... Is it Marth? Who needs to talk to this guy again? I forgot. <laughs> Am I enjoying the ambush response? Julian. Okay, so I do need to bring him down there. Thank you. Uh, am I enjoying the ambush response? No. <laughs> no, I had to do at least one restart um, because of the ambush response. Full send. I also don't like that I can't tab through characters. <laughs> For whatever reason, the like L and R don't let you do that. <laughs> Wait till you get to the 12 move ambush spawns. Those are the funnest. Oh, Wyvern Lord ambush spawns. <laughs> Good times. Good times ahead. I can tell. I can tell. Um, and I'm not looking at a guide either because I want like the full experience. I mean, I know I've listened to the playthroughs and like, I know generally about the game, like I knew that there would be ambush spawns, but I don't know where they're gonna come from. I don't know where they're gonna come from. Uh, so one more stall turn and then I don't have to worry about the arrows. Wyvern Dragon. Ah. Uh, nice. Oh, that's right, there are actual dragons in this game. That's, that's true. That's right. With capped speed and massive Oh, geez. Great. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like fun. It's a good time. I'm sure it's a good time. We're all, we're all here to have fun. We're all here to have fun, guys. We're here to have fun. Um, this is fine. Last one. Last one. Last damn one. Huh. Okay, so we've done that, and now they're coming up here, which is good. That's what we want. That was intentional. Okay, yeah. No, enjoy your lurks, and thanks for chatting. Thanks for chatting. Always appreciate folks hanging out. Enjoy your lurks. Enjoy your lurks. While this enemy phase is going on, I'm going to pop some links in chat. Um, we do have a Discord. I'm really bad at promoting that we have a Discord. So if you want to hang out in the Discord, we talk about food that we've made, you know, fun stuff, Pokemon, whatever. Um, we talk about good stuff there. I also have a Twitter, which may or may not last for a while. And then uh, I haven't updated it in a while, but we do also have a YouTube where previous runs are uploaded and categorized and all that jazz. Uh, so this sounds like a good time to you. Um, sounds like a good time to me. And uh, yeah, should be should be a lot of fun. Um, so, hmm. All right. I don't want what's his name to die. Which means we need to be careful about where we put power. Because I don't think Julian can reach from here. Uh huh. I 
just want to see what damage this guy does. Okay, so we will not kill him if he tries to attack us. Which is nice. We like that. Uh, Rody. I'm hoping that by having a unit that he can attack from two range that he won't get attacked back, that that'll help save Mathis from immediate destruction. That would be nice. How badly do we destroy him? Pretty, pretty badly, to be honest. Uh, let's see. Let's just do this. That's fine. Pala. Doing Pala things. How goes the map? It's going pretty good. Going pretty good, if I had to say so. Um, oh! Oh! Wait a second. I think we're okay. Yeah, everybody everybody is out of range. Um, the only person who might not be okay is Luke. Okay. Okay, okay. I thought that we were done with that. <laughs> but because of the miss, we're not done with that. <laughs> Alright, he's gonna hit Luke, so six. If it hits, which it did, of course, because what is my luck if not getting hit by a ballista with 57? Okay, attacking Rhodey's fine. Probably. Is he faster than Rhodey? It's a question that I don't know the answer to. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Posture check. Thank you for the posture check. And thank you for the hydrate. Appreciate that. If you guys have some water, please make sure you're drinking water. Lena, where are you? What I would give to hear your voice just once before I die. <laughs> Maybe don't attack from one range, you dumb dumb. I don't know what to tell you, man. This is on you. This is on you. Um, thank you for the hydrate. Please drink some water with me because it's good for you. Because it is good for you. Talk. Hey, cut it out. Why must you always insist on pointing your sword at us? Let's get a lance. I pity Lena for having to put up with your stupidity. Oh, it's you, Julian. Are you still trying to worm your way into Lena's good books? No way. I won't hand my cute little sister to a thieving rat like you. You can relax. Lena and I would never work out. Aw, but no! I already ship it. <laughs> but even if it's just a little, I wanted to help her in any way I could. Ooh, you finally realize where you stand. Attaboy, Julian. Uh, that's not the kind of thing I want to be hearing from you. Whatever. If you're worried about Lena, then come with me. Oh, alright, thanks. You see, they forced me to join the rebel army, but you know I hate fighting. Alright, little brother. Let's join forces and look for our cute little Lena. Alright. Kinda weird, but that's okay. We'll, <laughs> we'll, uh, we'll let it slide for now. We'll, we'll let it slide for right now. 
that this, go ahead and do this. I suppose. I suppose. I hate fighting, so I'll join you in fighting. Precisely. That's pretty much all Fire Emblem is. Fire Emblem is, uh... Hey, you look like you should probably not be doing what you're doing. And you hate fighting, so you should probably join us, right? 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 I think so. I want to test out, like, this whole, like, this is filled with spawns. <laughs> like, these, these are, this is just filled with enemies. <laughs> I want to know. I want to know. Um... Now that nobody's there, we can open the bridge and go across it. Seems like a good idea. Seems like seems like a pretty okay idea. Stay. <laughs> Bridges are not scary when there's no reinforcements. Uh, da -da -da. Uh, what shall we do? Somebody warned me that the, the armory was full of full of people in the rebel army. We found a bridge, Charlie! It's a Leoplurodon! Uh, this thing doesn't have any yeah, no ammo. Nothing. Nothing. Not EA. Quantity one hit point. Rody needs to be probably a different, um, a different class. I think it is. I don't know if this one's working out for him. I don't think it is. Luke was. Luke was a Myrmidon for a second there. Alright. So we're we're all on the island now. That's what matters. This guy doesn't know how to hit any the broadside of a barn. He can barely do anything. His little brother is far outshining him. Which is weird, because I don't think Ryan is supposed to be good. I don't know. But, you know, speed and strength seem to be his strong points, and he's been pretty bulky defensively. I love how it says he's unarmed, and it still looks like he has a giant, giant uh, bow and arrow. <laughs> Favorite. Favorite! Maybe it's because he doesn't have a whole lot of experience? Wow. Chippy chip. Unarmed, except for the arms. He's about to be unarmed. I guess Luke will get this. Boom. Boom goes the dynamite. Uh-huh. A nose pass. Now seems like a good time to save this chapter. Seems like a good time. I do want to test out whether this is uh, actually... Like, I think, I think Pala's a good candidate for early promotion just because she's Pala.
think we're fine. We're just gonna we're just gonna promote Pala because why not? I'd rather just do that. Ta-da! Her Pegasus turned into something not a Pegasus. Her Pegasus turned into a wyvern. That's so weird. Her res went down. Okay, that's fine. It's fine. Uh, everything else looks pretty good though. And she can use axes. Do 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 do. Thank you for redeeming those sound alerts. Are you hearing them? Are you hearing the sound alerts? Because I'm not. I'm not hearing them. Dragons are negative riz. <laughs> Pretty much. Pretty much. <laughs> I don't know what else to tell you. You don't think you heard them? Let me see if I can... I don't know if I'll be able to get them to work, but... We'll, we'll do them on the kazoo instead. We'll do them on the kazoo. But thank you for redeeming them anyway. I do appreciate um, I will make sure that that works for tomorrow. We'll make sure that that works for tomorrow. Let's see. Clap. <laughs> Pretty much. Pretty much. Um, you have 11 defense. This guy has 14 attack. So, pretty safe. D damn it. Why is the Altain army here? You're all going down with me. Die! Alright, buddy. Calm down. We're only trying to steal your castle that you've stolen from somebody else. To find the abducted princess who's been abducted by somebody else, also. Uh, eight. So, six. Definitely don't get... Oh, he dodged. Okay, so Catri doesn't do any damage, so she's just gonna chill. Uh, who had an axe? Did you have an axe? No. Somebody did. I'll take the axe. This guy has a hammer. I wonder. <laughs> um, I don't think so. <laughs> but it is funny. But it is funny. Uh, let's see. How much damage do I take? Uh, nine. And then is he faster? Then my very slow self. Nope, we're the same speed. We're the same speed. So, guess. I guess I'll use a thunder. I don't know. Thunder? A nos? Let's use a thunder. And then I can trade to have the nos. It always feels like that should do so much more damage. That was one thing I really liked about um, Order of the Crimson Arm, is giving certain um, damage boosts for certain types of magic against different units. So like, uh, against horses, against horses, um, fire worked really well, and then against armored units, thunder worked really well, because that makes sense, <laughs> honestly. Uh, so yeah. It was a good time. Um, 
I think we're gonna go in this thing. We're gonna go in the armory and see if that helps or not. Probably not. Um, okay. I just get obliterated by this javelin. And here's we're gonna crit. Okay. Goodbye, sir. <laughs> Have a lovely day. <laughs> Have a lovely day. <laughs> Completely healed. And you are gone. I didn't mean to take all that XP, but I guess we did. As I expected. Oh well. Here goes my curiosity. Armory! Good day. What can I help you with? Maybe, maybe there's not something here. A hand axe! I can't buy it. <laughs> I guess not. I guess not. I thought there was going to be reinforcements coming out of the armory for some reason. Too bad. Alright, let's seize and finish up the chapter. So it looks like we might end a little bit early depending on how much text there is. Sire, the rebels have fled the castle, but I regret to inform you that Princess Minerva is nowhere to be found. What could have happened? She was supposed to be held inside the castle. Your princess is in another castle. Oh, here comes a general. Oh, I knew this task was unworthy. Excellent work, work, Prince Marth. We'll take care of Macedon from here. Now, let us discuss your next mission. General Lang, what in the world do you want this time? Well, you see, my castle was attacked and the Grustian prince and princess were kidnapped. The perpetrator fled to Macedon, it seems. Prince Marth, you were to capture him and return the children to me. You're asking me to send those children to their doom. You're in no position to defy me. Now, off you, to work you go, my prince. You, your rudeness towards my liege has gone too far. Shut up. Prince Marth is not your minion. What did you say? Know your place, I'll say in the soldier. Marth, it seems that your countrymen are devoid of manners. I apologize on her behalf, but it is, it is as Happy says. General Lang, I will no longer follow your orders from here. Sire. What? Do you mean to defy my order? He literally just said he was going to do that. I see. I see. As I suspected, it was your doing. The person who kidnapped Grust's prince and princess was the mercenary Agma, on your orders, no less. I didn't know of this, but if I had the choice, I would have done exactly as you suggested. Back at Grust, even though they were meant to be our enemies, I should have helped those children. You, you clearly speak words of treason. Perhaps I should report this to the Emperor. Do as you will, but you're not the only person who intends to visit the palace. I will speak to Emperor Hardin and Princess Nina and inform them of your crimes. Forgive me, Jagan, but I cannot stand for this any longer. I understand. You have endured well until now. Lang, my liege may forgive your frequent rudeness to him, but I will not. Come, draw your sword. Even though I, Jagan, am old and senile. <laughs> he called himself senile. <laughs> I will not lose to the likes of you. What did you say? Damn you. I'll remember this. Once the Emperor gets wind of this, I'll crush your puny little Altea. Okay. Bye. He runs fast for a general. Jagan, you're a bag of surprises. <laughs> Jagan, the old and senile. Well, we're the ordinary, I guess. <laughs> to think you'd stand up against Lang like that. 
Sire, are you underestimating me in my old age? <laughs> I'm not about to let youngsters like Happy hog all the glory just yet. You keep putting me down. Stop being mean to me. Still, I'll admit it was somewhat foolish to contest with Lang, even if he did push my lord at every turn. Sire, Sir Jagan, what's our next plan of action? According to Lang, Ogma's on his way to Macedon. He probably intends to visit the village where Lord Wendell resides. Lord Wendell? Lord Wendell's a pontifex of Cadane. He fought as our ally in the last war. I hear he's living in Macedon now. It also happens that the children that Ogma saved were raised by Lord Wendell. So I'm sure it would be the perfect time to pay him a visit. Yes, understood. But I worry about Lang. I pray nothing bad shall happen. Well, that means that something bad's gonna happen, so, uh, thank you. Th thank you, <laughs> Jagan. Joy and sorrow. I guess let's see what the beginning of this holds, maybe. We got like half an hour until we normally end. Marth was unable to reunite with Princess Minerva, and so, in order to help Agma and the Gruskian royal children, he decided to visit Wendell, who was once the children's guardians. However, the home beach where Wendell resides is the dominion of the infamous Macedonian Vikings. Countless pirates await in Marth's pass. Will Marth be able to safely rescue the children? I don't know. Find out next time on New Mystery of the Emblem. Let's do our talk conversations. Uh, Sirius. Is that... is Sirius... Uh... <laughs> I gave him two prologues before something bad happens. <laughs> so many prologues. Absolutely not. Searching. I've returned with the scouts. These are the details. Hmm. We have to rescue Sir Ogma's group as soon as possible. What's this? Who's the paladin right beside Sir Ogma? The details are unclear. The scouts say he's a masked man of unknown identity. Hmm. But if he's a paladin, I doubt he's conspiring with those bandits. Depending on how we talk to him, he might even become our ally. Okay. Hey, you're Mart's, Prince Mart's personal knight, aren't you? Yeah, that's right. I'm happy. And you are? I'm Melicia. There's something I want to know. About my dear prince, Prince Mart. Your dear prince? Well, he is a prince, but... You see, men are such disgusting creatures, but Prince Marth is totally different. He reached out to me gently with his comforting eyes. He even promised to marry me right in front of Granny. Ah, uh, he did not. <laughs> no, he did not. I find that difficult to believe. Oh, I remember when I closed my eyes. As I was being pursued by bandits and cried for help, Prince Marth came gallantly galloping to my rescue while riding a white horse. Oh, he does not have a horse. My liege doesn't ride a white horse. Let's not fuss over the details. Oh yes, where should we hold our wedding? Prince Marth might want it in Altea, but I want Granny to see me in a wedding dress. And then, after the wedding, we'd look up at the night sky from the castle balcony, just the two of us. And I'd say, isn't it beautiful? And then he would whisper into my ear, that nearly as much as you are. And then, and then, we'd kiss gently under the moonlight. <gasps> Silly Melicia. Um, I'm sorry to interrupt at such an important part, but... <sighs> Please stop, Prince Marth. I'm so embarrassed. Prince Marth recently got engaged. But, but if you want to, then I... <gasps> she isn't listening at all. <laughs> I guess I'll just let her be. <laughs> oh, to have no shame. <laughs> it's a charger bug. In case you would like a charger bug, there's one in chat. We've quelled the rebellion in Macedon. However, Princess Minerva, thought to be in the rebels' grasp, is elsewhere. <laughs> Melissa is the queen of self insert fanfic. <laughs> Marth, uh, Marth X Reader, <laughs> she's the queen. She has got 100k written for her uh, self-insert uh, fanfic with Marth. Oh, yes. 
However, Princess Minerva thought to be in the Rebels' grasp is elsewhere. Who wouldn't want a literal bus Pokemon? Exactly. Exactly. Little chargey struggle bus Pokemon. We love the bus. If only we had met the princess, we might have been able to avoid confronting Lang like that. I myself have no regrets. The question is how he's going to react. Just hope he won't do anything bad. <laughs> According to Lang, Sir Ogma took the prince and princess of Grust and is going to meet Lord Wendell. We too came here to join Sir Ogma, but this is a pirate territory. We must proceed carefully. Okay. I guess it's not time to check in to see how everyone is. I don't know, do we think this is going to be a quick map? It's a seas map, so probably not. Quicker than the previous map. So we want to do this map today? This seems like a lot. Guile. Does he actually have Guile? I don't know. Camus! Serious. I don't know who's supposed to talk to this guy. Marth? Uh... Catria? Somebody? Anybody? Bueller? We're gonna save this for next time, I think. <laughs> I don't want to think anymore this morning. Um... So with that said, uh, let me change some screens here. We just go over here. We're gonna say thank you. Very, very. Um, we are going to find somebody to go raid. Bueller. Um, we're gonna go find somebody to raid. Uh, let's see who we got. Who we got? I'm gonna go find someone to raid playing some Fire Emblem, hopefully, or something else that's fun. Um, let's see. Let's... Let's do... Well, actually, Side was in here last time. Um, and it looks like... It looks like he's playing live games of Advance Wars. Um, so we're going to go raid Sidewinder. Thank you for being here, Slowpoke. Thank you for being here, Axum. Um, Side was in stream earlier. Excellent Fire Emblem player, player is currently playing, um, well, I think he might have just finished Fire Emblem Engage. Um, was playing another run of that, uh, which is a lot of fun. Today he's playing Advanced Wars by Web, um, one of the best fog map Advanced Wars by Web players um, ever. I think he's in the top 10 currently. Um, Wonderful person, wonderful streamer. Um, be sure to send some uh, raid love. F send your favorite emoji. Send this message. Tell him it's dangerous to go alone. Um, he needs to take this. Put in your favorite emojis. We have a raid follower emoji if you want. Um, we also have, because I'm bad at promoting this, we have a Discord. If you're interested in joining the Discord, um, get to hear all the things that are coming up. Um, sometimes when we don't know what we're doing on Fridays, I'll do a poll over there, figure out what you guys want to see. Um, and yeah, so tomorrow we have our usual Pokemon Infinite Fusion Soul Link Randomized Nuzlocke Challenge. Too many words, but we said them anyway, uh, with your Uncle Finch. And then, and then later, uh, we'll have a Friday stream next week. So we'll be doing some painting, I think, so... Thank you guys for being here. We will see you next time. Bye, guys.